So hey, I'm Simon K. Dell. I'm a stamp comedian, and I'm really impressed you all got here due to all the weird weather we're having, the nor'easter, Sandy, Halloween sucked. Thanks, God. I did go to a costume party, though. It went as Charlie Chaplin. I had the hat, suit, little mustache. There's one big thing with a Charlie Chaplin costume. Do not take off the hat. You will get a completely different costume. <laughs> Charlie Chaplin ate off it. <laughs> Speaking of traveling, we weren't. I just need a transition. I went on vacation recently. I took a plane and I browsed over the one fine feature that all aircrafts have, SkyMall. I actually have a theory about SkyMall. Here it is. It was invented only to give stand-up comedians material, because the stuff in here is really weird. But there's always that one normal thing that kind of throws you for a loop. I'd like to see the briefing for that at like the pitch. It's like, uh, Johnson, what do you have? Uh, I have a pocket-sized pipe organ. Good, Bill. Massage helmet. Uh, new guy, what do you have? I have a bread box. <laughs> Does it dry towels? No, it's a bread box. Is it USB compatible? No, it's a bread box. Is it travel sized? It is exactly the same size as a bread box. We've all seen this in 20 questions. Is it bigger than a bread box? Tell me something. When did bread box become a standard unit of measurement? It's like centimeters, inches, bread box. Seriously, and other than 20 questions, have you ever seen that used? It's like, uh, Bill, how much flooring do we need? Um, let's see, this room is about 20 by 40 bread boxes. <laughs> Give or take a toaster. <laughs> While I was on vacation, I went camping, and anyone who's gone camping must have heard of Smokey the Bear, the bear with the sign, only you can prevent forest fires. It's cute, but I had many problems in this guy. First of all, bear? When did bear become a symbol of safety? <laughs> Bears can do two things, okay? Steal picnic baskets <coughs> and maul people. <laughs> and second, Smokey. Can you think of a worse name? This guy's out here to prevent forest fires. Smokey the bear, what's next? Bommy the pacifist? <laughs> Meaty the vegan? They should have a marketing meeting. Uh, Smoke, your name goes against everything you stand for. You are now flame retardant the bear. Okay, and the last thing, this is what I'm most concerned about, is the slogan. Only you can prevent forest fires. Me? That's a lot of responsibility for a 13 year old boy. I've got bar mitzvah lessons, people. I can't stand right, wait, wait a second.